Hey friends, welcome back. Today we've got our weekly grocery haul from Aldi for you. For the first week of October and part of that week the kids and I are going to be in Michigan visiting family will is still going to be home so I'm going to be meal prepping because my husband and I are eating a ketogenic diet I'm gonna be meal prepping his food for while we're gone and my food to take with me I know that might sound crazy to some of you but I want to make sure that I stay on track because I have been doing so well and I don't want to go off track while I'm there so I'm gonna go ahead and prep my food and bring it in a cooler because it's an eight-hour drive again I know I'm crazy, but that way I also know that like what I bought for groceries this week should be all we need for groceries this week because I'm gonna be taking food with me. The only um, thing that has me kind of concerned about what I'll be eating is when we're actually on the road. So I'm gonna make sure to bring some keto-friendly snacks and if need be, we will stop at McDonald's and I will just get like burger, no bun. That's kind of the plan right now. I'm gonna do the best I can while in the vehicle and then while I'm at family's house, I will have my meal is completely prepared with me for the day, few days that we're there. So long story short, that's what's going on. Smaller haul this week. We still have lots in the pantry and stuff. The kids eat a lot of what we eat for dinner and there's alternate options if they don't want that, such as chicken or like sausage or hot dogs. And so let me show you what we got. All right, so this is what we got from Aldi. It doesn't look like much, but we spent $60.81 because we had to get some meat. Starting in the back, I've got one pack of romaine hearts, so there's three in there. That'll be good for our salads and stuff at dinner time. Back here, two bags of pork rinds, one of the original and one of the hot and spicy. A bag of oven roasted sea salted almonds. Up front, we got two containers of sour cream because we've been going through this a lot more quickly recently. Two heavy whipping cream. I use this in my coffee. We use it in our keto oatmeal. Uh, we'll add some into his protein shake. Two more pounds of butter. These will go in the freezer. I pull out a stick at a time and, uh, as I need it. Everything's in twos, not everything, but we've got lots of twosies. Two dozen eggs this week. Two packages of the turkey snack sticks. I usually get the beef, but they were out, and so I grabbed the turkey. These will go on Will's lunches for the week. These were on sale this week. Now, I don't know the difference between like the tube of meat, which just sounds odd, and then like the packaged plastic trays of meat. Um, I tried to like look to see if there's really any difference. These were on sale for $1.99 a pound. This is a five pound log of meat and it was $9.95 compared to the trays of meat which were $2.89 a pound. So I know we're gonna go through a lot of beef this coming week and so I grabbed two of these because of meal prepping that I'll be doing for Will as he stays here at home and then for myself in Michigan because I'm prepping everything before I go. So anyway, I don't know the difference. This was cheaper, this is what we went. Compared to the tray meat, I couldn't find a difference other than price. Back here we've got a jar of mild pepper rings. Those go in my husband's lunch. These are the 100 calorie classic guacamole minis. Not too bad for keto. It does have five carbs, but there's three fiber. So two net carbs per guacamole cup. And I figured we could put this like with our omelets or our salads in the afternoon to add a little bit more fat. Since avocados have been so darn expensive and I'm really missing that. We'll try this and see if that's a good replacement. Back here, I've got three cans of olives. I like these for a snack, so does Jackson. I'm gonna take those in my meal prep containers for when I go to Michigan. And then I got a container of natural creamy peanut butter. This is not the just peanuts, but Alice does isn't a huge fan of just like the creamy organic, like this is just peanuts and sea salt. So Alice doesn't like this one, but the rest of us do. So I got her the natural. Anyway, so that is our grocery haul for this week. And that's it. So hopefully you enjoyed this grocery haul and leave me a comment down below if you have any questions about what we eat on keto or anything like that. And until next time, we will see you later. Bye.